Yo, so today you are going to learn how to maintain a high performance state because there's no way around it. Our results are directly correlated to our performance. When our performance increases, our results increase. When our performance takes a dive, our results take a dive. So in the next 10 minutes here or so, you're gonna learn the top three ways to maintain a high performance state because then, hey, you're going to get more done, you're going to make more money, you're gonna help more people, and let's be honest, when we do the shit we say we're gonna do, when we honor our commitments in a high performance way, we feel good about ourselves. When we feel good about ourselves, life's better. So high performance stuff. Number one, serotonin. Serotonin, whether you know it or not, is a hormone that courses through our body that is directly correlated to our state. When serotonin levels are high, procrastination is low. Serotonin produces a feeling of calmness, of certainty, of clarity and confidence within the human body. So they've done studies with high performance individuals and guess what? they have higher resting levels of serotonin in their blood. So you need to increase your serotonin levels. So let's talk about that. The quickest way to do that is one, optimize sleep. Everyone knows, get six to eight hours of sleep. This will help with serotonin levels. But two, eat high tryptophan foods. And tryptophan is that stuff that everyone says is in Turkey around Thanksgiving that makes everybody tired. Tryptophan does not make you tired. It's eating copious amounts of food on Thanksgiving that makes you tired. But high tryptophan foods, tryptophan increases your body's ability to create serotonin. So what are some high tryptophan foods? It's just any, really any meat that is, is good. Any organic, grass-fed, non-GMO meat. So make sure you're getting good, lean, healthy meat sources in your diet. So good sleep and good meat, which is good sources of tryptophan, um, is actually gonna increase serotonin levels. The last thing to do to increase serotonin levels is a daily meditation practice. There's a reason why the most elite individuals in the world, the highest performers in the world, all have a meditation practice. Because meditation increases your body's resting serotonin levels in your bloodstream. So get good sleep, eat good meat, and what was the last one? So, 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 so get good sleep, eat good meat, and meditate every day. If you need some meditations, just go to wakeupwealthy.com. We have a whole bunch of free ones that are awesome. So optimize your serotonin levels and you're going to have higher performance. The second thing to increase your high performance state is to time block. And within your time block, nothing else matters except your time block. So when I say time block, I mean every single day you should be looking at your calendar because time is the most valuable resource that you have. And when we use our time in more valuable ways, we make more money because money is an expression of value. So when we do things that make our time more valuable, we make more money. It's a cool little correlation. So. You should time block your income generating activities or your revenue generating activities. You should time block them on your calendar, meaning like a doctor's appointment that you don't miss. Go on your calendar and you need to time block your income generating activities. And once that time block hits, when it's time, imagine like a construction worker with a hard hat, clocking in and clocking out. When you clock into that time block, put your phone on do not disturb, put it in a book bag, put it in a drawer, put it in the other room, and just focus on a single task for 25 minutes, an hour, two hours, whatever your time block is. Our brain is so much more effective and we enter a flow state when we do not multitask. So time blocking income or revenue generating activities um, and not allowing distractions into your time block will actually increase your performance over time. And you'll notice that within a week, you'll be able to get more done in what, what most people get done in a month when you're operating this way. Now, the last thing, the last thing that will allow you to maintain a high performance state is, and a lot of people, uh, a lot of people don't know this, but it's humor, it's joy, it's not taking things too seriously. And I know that sounds a little irresponsible when we're talking about high performance and making lots of money, but listen, when we get all tense, when we get all rigid, when we get a little too serious about things, what happens is we literally create tension in our body. And that tension in our body blocks the flow of energy through our body, right? It would be like if you had a water bottle and you went like that, 
right? Not a lot of water is going to be get, able to get through that, right? Or if, or if you take a hose and you twist it, right? Not a lot of water is getting through that hose. So when we stay open and we keep things a little light, when we joke around a little bit, right? When we can really bring a little humor and joy into what it is we're doing, it actually opens us up so that we have a higher, easier flow of energy through our mind and body, which means we actually have a higher output. We actually have more performance. And if you look at the best performers in the world, the best um, musicians, the best athletes, the best fighters, the best leaders, the best speakers, the best CEOs, they're not super duper rigid all the time. There's a flow to them. They're not white knuckling their life. They're not white knuckling their leadership. They're not white knuckling their performance. They bring a sense of ease to it. Why do you think that is? Is because what makes someone effective? It's their ability to entirely flow their energy, to focus their energy on a single task. But if you're too tense, energy can't get through. So bring a sense of joy, joke around. Don't take your shit too seriously. In not that much time, we're all gonna end up in the ground anyway, right? Everybody that you everybody that you compare yourself to, we're all the same. We all have insecurities, we all, we all sleep, we all shit, we all bleed, like we're all the same. So don't take yourself too seriously. Bring a little joy and humor into what it is you do, and you'll notice your performance increases. So let's just recap this whole sweet thing one more time. So you can increase your performance, spend more time in a high performance state, make more money, help more people, change the world, and just feel good about yourself. One is remember, increase your serotonin level. Good sleep, eating high quality meats and proteins, and also having a daily meditation practice. Those will increase your serotonin levels, which will increase your performance and sense of well being. The second thing is time block, distraction free time blocks. Obviously, you probably already knew that, but it works. Do it. The simple stuff that works, works. Uh, and the last thing is bring a little uh, joy and humor into what it is you're doing, and you'll notice that you actually get more done than if you were to just be tense and super serious the whole time. Use these three tips. Spend more time in a high performance state and your performance will lead to better results. For more trainings, head to wakeupwealthy.com. We have tons of free trainings for your life, your mindset, your business, and uh, to develop yourself as a leader, man. So head there. We'll see you there or we'll see you in the next uh, YouTube video. So see you later.